This might sound like something from a charlatan in Victorian era medicine, but electricity can help heal your wounds, y'all. Hey everyone, I'm Trace. Thanks for tuning in to DNews. That's what I said, electricity can help heal wounds, and not in the androids of the future, or the Borg, or something, but right here, plain old meat bags. In 1791, Italian physician and philosopher Luigi Galvani took a dead frog and used small amounts of electricity to cause the frog's leg to twitch. He discovered muscles move with electrical contraction. Then in 1843, German physician Emile dubois Raymond founded the field of electrophysiology, the idea that the human body and other animal bodies have their own electrical properties. And since then, we've learned how animals have this web of electrical transmission lines extending throughout our systems into every nook and cranny of our bodies. More recently, scientists learned under the skin is a faint electrically ionized field running parallel to the surface at around 100 millivolts. And though you can't sense it, your cells can. When the body is wounded, the current changes course, running perpendicular to the skin instead of parallel. This is like an air raid siren for the cells of the body, signaling that the flesh needs help from the body's healers, platelets, white blood cells, proteins, you know. At the University of Aberdeen, researchers used very low level electrical fields to help wounds heal and flesh regenerate 50% faster than letting it go on its own. The problem was, it was documented 150 years ago by Emile dubois raymond Over 150 years after these researchers discovered these electrical fields, Stanford scientists found that animal cells use these electrical fields to usher the repairment of the body toward a wound and the innocent bystander cells away from the danger zone. Danger zone! The cells rushing toward the wound have two little markers on them. One is pointing them toward the wound like a compass that always knows where to go. The other is blocking out other electrical signals. This is kind of like a siren on an ambulance, but even better and on a microscopic level. It's sort of similar. <laughs> the cool thing is, even now, after hundreds of years of science, there is still a lot more stuff to find out about the inner workings of our body. Armed with this new knowledge, doctors may be able to develop bandages that use small electrical fields to draw healing cells to desired parts of the body and drive away those cells that they don't want to interfere with the healing process. They could also speed up tissue repair and regeneration, all with just a few millivolts. Have you ever been shocked? I mean. I stuck my fingers in an electrical socket when I was a kid, but there must be some crazy electricity stories out there. Share them with us, post them on our Facebook or Google Plus pages, tweet them at us at DNews, or leave them in the comments. Thanks for tuning in everyone, I'm Trace, this is DNews, we'll be seeing you.